My name is Sabrina Pantier. From the movie, I expect to be inspired because, uh, I mean, it just uh, realized something great and uh, from nothing and with courage and determination. And I just want to be inspired by him and yeah, to have great ideas and just to be myself as well and do great things too. I'm Lauriane Guichanduc, very French name also. <laughs> I'm really uh, hoping a lot uh, about this movie. I'm expecting also a lot about it. Uh, we are in Paris next to uh, the Champs Elysees at the Publicis Cinema. And uh, yeah, it's gonna be great. See you soon on Fashion TV. Oh, my name is Remy, I'm a tailor. I'm with my uh, wife, who is also a tailor, who designed many clothes from the people you just saw. We are very happy to be uh, invited to this event. Thank you to uh, Mr. Ferrero. And um, yeah, we we'll hope to enjoy the movie. A bit of inspiration also, and maybe we can copy some of uh, the models of uh, Mr. Tahadi, of course. <laughs> so yeah, I think we'll see uh, great things. Uh, we're more traditional, uh, actually. We're just um, inspiring from um, Dior, Saint Laurent, Chanel, very French tailoring uh, style. Please come and enjoy the <laughs> premiere of the United States of the Elite Harry here in Champs Elysees in Paris. Come with us. Uh, no, I don't know the designer, but I'm really happy to discover designer uh, through this documentary. So I'm happy to, to see uh, this documentary. Uh, I'm wearing a Jacquemus vest and a Chanel uh, tight, yeah, <laughs> and uh, that's all, like a Chloe bag and a Prada shoes. My name is Lorraine Torres, see you soon on Fashion TV. Hello, my name is David Sorriro. I'm an opera singer, but I'm also the director and the producer of this fashion movie that you guys are gonna see tonight. And I'm so happy to be here. Well, you know, I must thank COVID in a way because I didn't have any shows that I knew that I will be going to movies and that was the perfect opportunity. And I knew Ellie just a couple of months before. So I met with him and we talked and I told him I want to do a movie about you and I have this amazing partnership with uh, Amazon. So I said, let's do it. And that movie went skyrocket all across the US because it went to so many film festivals, more than 100 and won many awards. And I'm so happy that it's coming on the Champs-Élysées Avenue in Paris. And of course, it will go after uh, to Amazon Prime and many other platforms. So it's basically, it's the story of his life, but also through his life, you carry so many, you know, decades of fashion and so many things that he has done because he has created uh, a lot of things in terms of fashion. He created the, the tube top, but also he popularized uh, the business suit for women. And he came from a very special uh, origins, which you're gonna discover in the movie. And uh, he's one of the top major um, uh, I would say designer in the in America. He has over 600 stores and created a billion dollar empire. So we owe him a lot, you know. I invite all of you guys to watch it and I hope this movie will soon be for my friends on Fashion TV. Hello, my name is Nabil, I'm director. I'm so happy in the place, it's a good place. The cinema is publicist in uh, Paris, Champs Elysees. Uh, my best friend is uh, David Serra, he's a very good artist, good uh, documentary. He's very good respect my friend because uh, the, the movies, it's very good history in uh, the, uh, the movie star designer in, uh, in uh, Morocco, in uh, France and, uh, and America. Yes, it's a good movie. Tell us where we are right now. When I ran out of money, I was sleeping on the bench in Central Park. It feels good to sit on it. 
<laughs> Ellie's story is the American dream. I am Ellie, a simple man. I was born in Israel. My parents went back to Iran. Well, I don't remember a lot because I was very young. I do remember that they lived in tent or metal sheet housing. No electricity, no running water. And I remember the other kids used to make jokes out of me because my clothes were dirty and wrinkled. Because I had a free ticket, I stay one night, I had $60, and I stayed at YMCA, and I refused to go back home. It's Tahari. Mm, that's what's important. <laughs> <laughs> 